I'm Terry Corcoran. And I'm Elise Sondheim, and you're watching Ward TV. Last week, the French Hospitality Club hosted the annual Mardi Gras celebration. Ward TV was there to bring you the highlights. But first, here's the question of the week. What is your favorite TV show? Check it out. Uh, my favorite show is definitely Samurai Jack. The, the Office. Office. Most Daring. Seinfeld. Danny Phantom. Family Guy, baby. My favorite TV show is Lost. My favorite TV show is It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, although you kids shouldn't watch it. Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. My favorite TV show is Desperate Housewives. Batman. Law and Order, SVU. UFC. Jersey Shore. SpongeBob SquarePants. <laughs> Are you skipping the Mardi Gras? That's right. It's a great form of transportation. On Tuesday, March 16th, the French Hospitality Club celebrated the holiday of Mardi Gras, also known as Fat Tuesday. This French festival traditionally involves wild celebrations, colorful masks and beads, exciting music, and lots of good food. Students brought many exotic dishes to school, including coco vin, jambalaya, bouffourignon, and more. Several band students also volunteered to play live music throughout the day. Overall, Mardi Gras was a successful celebration of fun and food. And, as the French like to say, Bon appétit! Today what we're going to talk about is a, uh, a program that uh, was brought to us by a software company called Anderson Software, and it's, it's called Texative. Yo, are you ready to uh, bring into Kenny Willis' house up to school today? Yeah, we're going to steal all this <laughs> It's going to be awesome. You would, you would text to 274637. That is the number that you would text to. And then in the body, in the narrative of the report, you would simply just write tip either 373 or FPD and your message. And then you just hit send. This is a high tech sort of uh, way of students being able to relay information to a police department completely anonymous. If you think that it's something that's crazy or you think that you overhear something that's weird, you can give us a tip anonymously and we will never know who you are. Most crimes are not solved by police officers alone. It's solved by direct cooperation from the citizens. Welcome back. You're watching Ward TV. Remember that Battle of the Houses will be coming next week. So Fitz House, show your spirit by buying a t-shirt. Now, here's a message from Kevin Callahan about the Freshman Forum on Underage Drinking. Check it out. Hello, my name is Kevin Callahan and I want all freshman homerooms to listen very carefully. Next Thursday, March 25th, from 7 to 8.30 p.m., there will be an assembly on the dangers of underage drinking for the freshman class and their parents. Yesterday, Ludlow had their assembly on underage drinking and over 500 people attended. As rival schools, we must beat them at everything. Therefore, we need all freshmen and their parents to attend. Now I know that you would like to be doing other fun things like homework, but for those that attend, there will be a reward. Your homeroom could win a free breakfast courtesy of Mr. Coyne if you get the highest percentage of kids in your homeroom to attend. All PE teachers and health teachers will be giving extra credit to everyone who attends. On top of that, if your house has the highest percentage of freshmen who attend, your house will be rewarded points at the annual Battle of the Houses. Don't let your homeroom down, and don't let your house down. Let's go, Pequot. Are you laboring in writing or artistic or obscurity? Do you feel like no one appreciates your work? Well, we have the cure for you. Submit your creative writing or art for publication in the Odyssey in Mr. Flynn's room, F5. The deadline is April 5th. Spread the word! Well, that's all the time we've got. The first day of spring was on Saturday, so happy spring. I'm Terry Corcoran. And I'm Elise Sondheim. And, and we're, we're out. out.